Uh, today I'm doing the stay home reading tag and um, I'm going to be looking down here from, for the questions. Uh, this tag is started by Ariel Bisset and I'll leave a link to her original video in the description. The first question is how is reading going while staying home? Um, my reading is going uh, almost as normal. I still have work when it's not the holidays. Um, and um, yeah, I've just been staying away from like slightly more angsty books and keeping to the sort of low angst, high fluff <laughs> content. <laughs> Next question is um, where have you been reading at home? I've been reading on my sofa, like mostly on my sofa. Um, yeah, I posted a video a few days ago of me reading. That's my reading spot. <laughs> yeah. Uh, next question. Best book you've read during isolation? Uh, that would be this book, How to Stop Time by Matt Haig. Um, it's about a guy who like lives an abnormally long time and then like secret society of these people who have this condition and yeah he he's struggling with living and not just existing and uh, it was pretty sweet so i like this one um next question what's your favorite feel good book um i would have to cop out and say a series it's the san andreas shifters series by g l carragher um my favorite is the most recent one which is called the omega objection and um just be warned it's uh, not safe for work <laughs> though uh, you know you're in your ho own home um yeah it's it's a romance and um it's it just fills my heart with joy they're so kind to each other and um yeah it's, it's so nice uh for a safe for work pick um pride and prejudice i mean it's a classic i've read it several times and especially the audiobook read by um rosamund pike that's uh, it just calms me right down and it's a very good um, escape, kind of. This is the edition that um, was made together with uh, Lizzie B the Lizzie Bennet Diaries. I mean, pretty bingeable. If you want something to binge, you could binge the Liz Lizzie Bennet Diaries. It's a sort of vlog adaptation of um, Pride and Prejudice. So, you know. Um, for another, like, Slightly in between pick, um, there's a short, like a short story novella kind of thing uh, that's called How to Marry a Werewolf by Gail Carragher. And that also, like, if I'm having a stressful time or something, that book will just calm me right, right down. Next question. Book you wish you could buy or borrow from the library? I'm mostly trying to focus on reading from my TBR, as in books I own but haven't read yet. But I am waiting for two books that I have tried to pre-order. One is the paperback version of Because Internet by Gretchen McCullough. I don't know if I'm pronouncing her name right, sorry. Um, it's a book about internet linguistics and I just really want to read it. <laughs> But it's been in the post since February, so uh, we'll see. We'll see when I get it. Uh, the other one is Queen of Coin and Whispers by Helen Corcoran. I'm not sure I'm pronouncing that right either. And um, her publishing date was supposed to be end of end of April, I think. And now it's been pushed back to June or July. I just really want to read this book. <laughs> it's about a queen who uh, falls in love with her spy master. And um, yes, 
two women loving each other. I just really want to read it. <laughs> but yeah, June, I guess. Uh, and then we have next question. An author you want to shout out in these times. I want to shout out Gail Carragher. She makes great like escapist reads um, and it's very good to know that I have her books to go back to if I need it in a pinch. And the last question is what is your stay home reading rush TBR? So that's the reading uh, reading rush slash uh, what's it called? Book read read readathon readathon <laughs> that's happening from next Thursday coming Thursday uh, to the coming Sunday um, there's going to be events on Twitter and Instagram as well um, and my TBR is a portable shelter by Kirsty Logan and Heartstopper Volume Two by Alice Oseman I've already made a video about this TBR and why I picked them and how they're fulfilling the uh, challenges but um, so, so have a look at that but yeah I'll be trying to read these books over those four days and um, I'm not trying to stress too much <laughs> if I don't get them done I, I don't really care that much so yeah that was the stay home reading tag if you want to do this tag feel free. Um, you don't really have to be one of the participants of the stay home uh, reading rush if you can just skip the last question if you want. Um, but yeah, it would be nice to hear people's like go to feel good book. That would be a uh, very good for these times. <laughs> so anyway, that was it from me and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.